You know, last week we had Scott Gorham on the show and we were looking over some of Thin Lizzy's producers and what they brought to the records. This makes me want to ask about 1985's Soldiers Under Command album, which had Michael Wagner on board and then you brought in um, Stefan Gulfus for To Hell With The Devil. What prompted the change in producers? Were you seeking, I guess, a commercial, less metal sound? Yeah, we were back, especially in those times, we were always trying something new. Now, you know, that can be uh, a really uh, risky thing to do. Uh, But also it can be very gratifying uh, if you do it right. And specifically, especially back in the 80s, we were doing that. So, you know, we worked with Ron uh, Gowdy on the first album. Uh, co-produced and then we worked with Michael Wagner obviously who was like you know uh, a really brilliant established metal producer Mm. and then after that album Soldiers we wanted to kind of take it up a notch not that Michael couldn't do that but we wanted to branch out and work with someone that uh, had done some different things and not necessarily just metal so we wound up working with Stefan Gelfast and we co-produced that album Uh, and it wound up being our biggest album so it was it was risky, but it was a good call. We're going to close out this show uh, with the title track from 1985's Soldiers Under Command, co-written, I believe, by yourself and Robert. Very much a song which defines who the band were at that time. What's the history behind the song Soldiers Under Command? And I guess, was it written specifically for that record? It was written specifically for that record. We had been playing a, a number of those songs out in public, for quite a while before we recorded them. So when we went in to record with Michael Wagner, we wound up just banging those songs out. Robert tracked the drums in in a day, a day and a night. Uh, We tracked the guitars in a few days, a bass in a few days, uh, and then background vocals in a day, and lead vocals in a few days, and then it got mixed. So it was a very quick process because we knew what we were doing. I remember Michael Wagner just kind of smiling through it all and saying, after we do a take, he'd say, yeah, perfect. I, I don't know what else to say. It's great. And um, it just really went well. Uh, and the song itself, Soldiers Under Command, has a little bit of a Judas Priest vibe to it. Mm-hmm. it, it we're huge Judas Priest fans, especially me. 